training for the rear cross without any equipment or any tools. We're going to have the dog, yourself, and your treats. I've got cookies in both my left hand and my right hand. And I'm going to start by turning her away from me using my left hand and following through and rewarding out of my right hand. And this is something that even a skilled dog can go back and practice, maybe adding in the verbal cue of switch or back or something like that. But to start with, for the beginner dogs, we're just going to let the dog figure out to turn away from us. We're teaching the dog the mechanics of the rear cross. So I'm just going to show you with Bindi here. Let's go. She's turning, and then I'm going to reward with my right hand. Good girl. Let's do that again. Turn her away, reward with my right hand. Now I'm going to switch sides because I want balance and I want her to be able to do it either direction. Take a couple of steps, turn her away, follow through and reward with my right hand. Or left hand, sorry. Right hand turns her away, left hand reward. So this is just the beginning of our rear cross training. Something you can do anywhere, anytime. You don't need anything except your dog and some treats. All right. Okay, now we're ready to move on to part two. I wanted to show you my setup here. I have my cone or trash can or whatever it is you're having the dog circle around. And then I've put two leashes down to act as a guide for myself in doing these exercises. You could use painter's tape. You could use um, any kind of mark on the ground if, if you were in sand you could just draw a line but I think it's very helpful to have some sort of guide to utilize when you're doing these exercises we're gonna have the dog circle around the trash can again but the lines are gonna help us establish where the dog should be and where we should reward so in this case if I'm gonna start with my dog on my right I will bring her around the trash can, following through and rewarding with my left hand once they've completed um, circling around. So I put these down just to help guide myself in the right direction as they're executing their circle around the can. Now, let me get the dog and demonstrate for you. Right direction. Let's start again. Good girl. 